Well, after more than two decades in the biz and with countless hits under her belt, our next guest is the definition of a Hollywood superstar. <laughs> And I am Amy Poehler. Here Amy Poehler here. is one of the funniest women on the planet. Meryl Streep is not here tonight. She has the flu and I hear she's amazing in it. The superstar first rose to fame on sketch series Saturday Night Live. And I am going to gently rub my hand through your hair so Before her scene-stealing role as the coolest mum um, ever. Is there alcohol in this? <gasps> oh, God, honey, no. What kind of mother do you think I am? <laughs> Why do you want a little bit? Because if you're going to drink, I'd rather you do it in the house. Then came her turn as a competitive figure skater, followed by an unruly surrogate in Baby Mama opposite bestie Tina Fey. Your water is breaking. i got to get a bus to take me to the hospital. Who she starred again with in Sisters. I like the story it tells with the fringe. Oh, here we go. On the small screen, Amy made a splash as Leslie ah. Knope. I can't feel my face. My face is numb. Parks and Rec becoming one of the world's favourite sitcoms. So to all your kids all across the land, no need to argue, parents just don't understand. And who could forget her roles in some of the best animated flicks, from Shrek to Horton Hears a Who and Inside Out. Let's make a list of all the things Riley should be happy about. Now, nearly 10 years after it first premiered, Amy is heading back inside the mind for Inside Out 2. Welcome to headquarters, embarrassment. Oh, we're doing a fit? No. Oh, <gasps> nope. Going high. Oh, you got a real sweaty palm there, buddy. <laughs> oh, I tell you, sweaty it's got palm. Sweaty I know how that feels. Oh, my God. We are Bang so excited moment. to say the supremely talented Amy Poller is here. Live in Hooray! today's show. Bravo! Amy. Bravo! Thank oh, you. Welcome. This is such an incredible moment to see you in the flesh. I'm so happy to be here. Welcome to Australia. Have you been having fun? <laughs> so much fun. Um, I've had so many jaffles since I've been here. Oh, oh yeah. good. Cheesy, delicious. Mm, delicious. Vegemite? Yeah. No, thank you. <laughs> that was a dead note. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, look, That's okay. Sarah's interviewed uh, worldwide stars, but you are by far and away her absolute favourite. Can she... you stop embarrassing me? No, no, it's not. It's not. It's so I, embarrassing. You know, going, it's just going. lovely to see her completely quiver. <laughs> on the oh, no. You should go and sit closer. It's okay. It's all right. Don't I don't want to rip the you. camera shut. <laughs> yeah. How is it out here again? I mean, it's been 10 years. Yeah, it's so, so nice to be back. It feels mm. like it's good luck to um, kind of launch the film here because that's what happened with the first Inside Out. So, mm. so happy to be back. You play the character Joy, of course. I mean, that's not too far from the truth, is it? Well, I mean, I wish I was like Joy. I mean, I think the, the, that character is this engine who pushes people and energizes people. And to play her is really exciting because you have to really... You have to have a lot of coffee. To <laughs> <laughs> We're used to that. We know the feeling. <laughs> um, look, there's puberty. There's some big themes mm. this time around as yeah. well. Yeah. So. In this, in the second one, our character Riley is turning 13, and just when everyone thinks that everything is fine, and Joy says, "We've done our job. We've raised our girl. Yeah. Nothing can happen." New emotions um, smash into the headquarters and change it up. It's crazy, isn't it? I mean, and you would know about that. We went through it ourselves, yes. right? Obviously, you got a couple of kids yourself. It's yeah. very, it's raw. It's right there. It's what's so good about Pixar is they're talking about things like anxiety mm. and envy and embarrassment, but they're making it into this visual feast. Um, I just think it's a really good film for our time. It's been a complicated 10 years and yeah. uh, since the first one, and it's just what they do so well. It sure has been, mm. and a complicated yeah. time for teenagers. For sure. And I have to say, you do not have to be a teenager to have anxiety. No. no. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> yeah. How did you get through COVID? Oh, gosh. Oh, God. How long do we have? Oh, no, we've triggered the anxiety <laughs> again, haven't we? How long do we have? No, I know. I think it's been... I, I think what Pixar does so well is they take young people's feelings um, very seriously. Mm. You know, they, they really... Um, do tender research and really try to figure out a way to talk about something that's mm. big and esoteric in a very mm. funny way. But if you loved the first one, I think you're going to love this one too. Yeah, it's absolutely. So good. I mean, I know Carl was having a bit of fun with me fangirling over you, but the, it's the true. reality is with the with the movies, with the shows, SNL, obviously, all the work that you do, I just feel like you ha you get people, you understand humans, and that's what makes it so funny because it's so relatable. Thank you. Thank you. I, I think 
Thanks for saying that. I, I think, uh, yeah, I think we're all very complicated, but we're not that different, all of us. I mean, I think we all are going through the same stuff. Who am I? What do I want? What do I care about? Mm. You know, same kind of stuff. Some of those scenes in Mean Girls. I, I mean, they just <laughs> live in my brain on the Well, constantly. that woman is kind of, she's her own island. She's a strange lady, that character. I don't know. Oh, I'd like funny. to live next door to her. <laughs> I know. What a hurt. Oh, I know. She's got great style. A lot of Australian <laughs> mums relate. Yes. A lot of American mums relate. Yeah, I think every, uh, that, that film, I did it when, um, I was only a few years older than the actress, than Rachel McAdams when I was playing her mom. Um, isn't that funny? Isn't that funny? Look at that little Look sweatshirt. Look at you! <laughs> with yeah, your little mocktails. That and... was so fun. <laughs> so fun. And, the, and that dog scene with the, the dog gnawing away at, yeah. you know, let's not mention that now. A but... classic. <laughs> Too early, too early in the morning. I want to take you a little bit back to SNL because, yes. I mean, this is a great you, is yeah. that you're able to do animation mm -hmm. uh, yeah. and you're able to do SNL. Here's a little yeah. snippet. Oh, gosh, this is like... You're upset. Oh. Tell John Bon Jovi what's wrong. Oh, God. <laughs> no one understands me. I'm worried that my life is going to suck even when I'm wicked old, like 30. <laughs> and don't even get me started on boys. Ah, the boys can be tricky. Yeah, tell me about it. I made out with Kevin Parker, and he told everybody that I smelled like Doritos. Oh, that's not important. Look, I'm here to tell you that everything is going to be okay. It's easy for you to say you're John Bon Jovi. Hey, growing up was hard for me, too. <laughs> Stole a kiss with John I Bon Jovi. I did. I mean, that success yeah. is having the guy that ha was hanging on your wall be in a sketch with you later. Legend. Right? That's absolute cool. legend. In fact, a, a fun fact about him: when he did that sketch, they got that outfit from storage, and he still fit in. Yeah, no, he's course. fit as. Yeah. Uh, bon there's, I mean, there's so much photo SNL. I mean, you've got Trumpy. You may get reelected again. Yeah. So there's just going to be an ongoing. Yes, I mean, I material. You know, the the young and wonderful people that work there now do mm. have to handle all that material. I luckily don't. Don't. <laughs> but yeah, I'm, there's there's never lack of material. I saw a great story about you um, that you because Prince is one of my favorite artists mm. ever, right? Yeah. So you, can you tell us the story about how you had an opportunity? Not only to, to meet him, but like anything, the world was your oyster with Prince. What happened? Well, uh, we have amazing musical guests at SNL who come through, and we have the privilege of often getting to watch them do a sound check. And Prince is one of my favorite artists, too. And he, he uh, rehearsed, and then he walked off stage, and he was coming towards me. And I thought, this is my moment. <gasps> this is my moment to make wow. an impression, to have him remember me, <laughs> to say something really profound, to tell him how much I loved his yeah. music. Yeah, yeah, and what? And he walked up, and I said, how was your summer? <laughs> <laughs> That's what she said. That's not what I said. I'm and glad he, I didn't ask you that He didn't question. answer. He just, he went by. <laughs> Can you imagine? Like my a summer breeze. Chance, <laughs> my one chance. How was your summer? Well, what do you <laughs> say? Prince. It, it is a tough one. What would you say to Prince? Oh, oh yeah. Like, right? Like, you know, it, yeah. he's just like, how did you write Purple Rain yeah. in, in the summer? <laughs> <laughs> did you I don't write know. it in the summer? <laughs> I would go completely to water. But you meet um, these wonderful people all the time. We you do. work we, with them. We get to see, uh, when you do SNL, you just have these wildly famous people walk by. But you get over it pretty quick because, you know, you have a show to do. Mm. You know, when you're when you're doing a show like this, you it's kind of like an emergency room. You get you get you used to the pace mm. and yeah. You're doing so much um, and continue to do. Well, um, and producing yeah. as well. Yeah. I mean, you're doing a lot of behind the scenes stuff. Yeah, we, uh, we've been producing and uh, writing and doing a bunch of projects and working on a bunch of things and it's been an awesome, since I've seen, since I've been to Australia, an awesome 10 years as well as a complicated. How do you fit uh, it all in? Uh, doubles, body doubles. <laughs> There's two other of me on other shows right now. I, I, would, I would believe yeah. that, actually. Yeah. <laughs> um, Tina Fey, um, yeah. can you please tour with her? Please. Yeah. Yes. We, w we would love to come here. That would be a dream. We've been doing a show in the States for the yeah. past year, and it's been awesome. Um, we've been out on the road. And, you know, we really like to party on the road. We get to a, sh you know, a city. We do our show at 5 p.m., we have oh, that's that's good hours. What a life. Yeah, that's clever. Yeah, right. But this is the thing. I mean, you guys yeah, are hosting. It's a dream. The, like, it's just incredible. Look, we've got a massive cake here. I think yeah. there's nine tears. We could probably oh send God. one of those tears now, to Tina. Now, is that one of those fake things that isn't a cake? No, Why don't you go and real. try it? I know. 
Uh, can you can I allow can Sarah walk with you over there oh, just to fulfill a lifetime dream? Sarah, it does feel like we're getting married and this is the cake in our house. Yes, yeah. She would do that. Do, 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 do. Oh, I walk over yeah, there. Let's go. Let's and go Sarah, try. do you, let's go do try you have cake. intrusive thoughts like I do? So do is there a part of you that wants to smash this? Yeah, yes. I also want something to jump out of it at oh, the same time. Oh, yeah. I can jump out of it. <laughs> we need a tool to smash it. Now wow, I'm, this I'm is really sure it's who real. made this? It's beautiful. I made it, I made it last night. I worked on it last this night. This cake is filled with bees when you open it up. <laughs> it is wonderful to see you. Thank You're an absolute you. legend. Thank Inside you so Out much 2 will be in me. cinemas on June 13. So go you all and see it. Um, real privilege to have you in. Thank you. you she's not going to let you out. No. <laughs> hold on We're going to your hide leg. you in that cake. You're oh not going God, anywhere, okay? There's, there's room, I reckon, in there. <laughs> she will hold on to your leg. Don't worry about that. This is something else. <laughs> One, two, three, smash! Hey, do it. Just do it. Shall we? Shall we? Have we got a baseball bat? Anywhere, someone? No, no. We'll be back right after this. Smash cake and all. Hey there, Today fans, Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh my God. Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube <laughs> channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. That never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?